liefste oma. This year, I came to learn about the Arabic word Jad. It means grandfather, but the same word Jad, it can mean to renew something. And renewal, not in the sense of replacing, but renewal to care for what was and to restore its greatness through new elements. Jad can also mean hard or diligent work and the attainment of knowledge. And it has one more meaning, departure. So this Jad, I had to think of Opa in relation to this truthful cycle in the way the word was originally created and existed. And I hope you can feel an immense amount of joy in knowing that you nourish all of us who flower in continuation of you. I'm so proud of that belonging. You know, I wish to be in contact with your and Opa's work. How can I cherish the the remarkable spirit of your creativity. And I've come to realize that in my own way, I do. When I think about how Opa might have directed natural sunlight into his designs, I might ask myself, how can I harness that image of light um, to influence the way in which it radiates my skin to move me. Or how Opa insisted on a lifetime um, with a view of the ocean. I seem to be spending a lot of time trying to be a soft body of water. Or how Oma might fall in love with the distinctions of a rose a dissolving color, or a sweet scent, or the way in which a petal unfolds. I might wonder how can I assimilate those distinctions to find a gesture in me.
heard Opa once say that one sees himself or one associates himself with the things he's made. And I, I can recognize that this house, the S, it's come in return to reflect your grace. In architecture, it's common to talk about materiality or choice of materials, but we can do it also in dance. Uh, that at any given moment, the texture of your form is a conscious choice. I think about Opa's integrity and the way in which he employed functionality and simplicity in his designs. And I think that perhaps my capacity for exercising integrity would be that I move with awareness, that no movement I do is done without a total awareness. At least, this is how I would like to grow up. Or Opa's love and employment for organic forms. Perhaps my employment would be that whatever movement, no matter how challenging, I try to find an organic way in which to organize it in my body. And when I think about how Opa and Oma would have researched how to best accommodate the needs and the happiness of the residents for the homes that they designed. I find a way or search for a way in which to inhabit myself so that it can accommodate my work. I read something beautiful by the poet Mary Oliver. She said, perhaps the desire to make something beautiful is the peace of God that lives in each of us. I hope that next year I will be here to celebrate your 100th birthday in the S. And I hope that this house, the S, will always be filled with um, dance and music and a dedicated hard work, creative work, restorative work as it was designed to be and as it should be. And I would like to tell you that it's your presence in me that is my heritage that I work to restore. Okay, where's Julian? He can come back now. <laughs>